What's up guys? This is the Brofoman and I am back to bring you to the next episode of my Empire Total War Let's Play is the United States of America. And in this episode, we're attacking another Austrian army. An Austrian army that's been in the south of France for an awful long time. Now we're finally advancing in this area against Austrian positions in Italy. Um, but first we must attack this force, which has got a lot of cavalry, a lot of artillery, and a bit of infantry. So we're going to be somewhat aggressive in the attack, anticipate the cavalry charge at the start. Once we've broken them, push forward to the guns, wipe them out, push them eastward. So we have two armies in the area ready to help. Um, this army is probably going to defeat. This action is going to push this army eastward. The army we've got to the north of this one is going to sweep around across the Alps into Savoy from the north. Right, so deploy the guns behind us. How it says by a quick climb. Deploy in our infantry line. So we're going to advance slowly and steadily. We're not bothered about the enemy infantry this action at all it's just all about the cavalry and artillery so much so the guns well really the first thing we want to do is make sure we storm forward because we don't want to be hanging around You have. Okay, the artillery. Attack the enemy cavalry. Don't worry about attacking the enemy guns. That's why we're going to storm forward at speed, because, yeah, again, my shrapnel shards also tearing us a new one. Anything, I think. The infantry on the right need to storm up very fast. Just want to minimise our exposure. Don't mind if provincial cav come after us. Gunners engage the infantry in the centre. These teams attack the guns, run the ranges up to somewhere over here. Right, so where the cavalry's hit us here. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, we probably want infantry in there as well. How is the switch to round shot? We need to attack. Well, we really need to focus our guns on the infantry just to prevent us from being slowed down slowed it down. One gun team dealt with. Okay, infantry that's in this engagement. Let's pan infantry. Push forward. Okay, my light cavalry, or my other, my regular cavalry, what the hell? How did, where did he...? <laughs> Captain America is attacking this gun team. No, 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 not you. You stay doing what you're doing. Very well. Two gun teams defeated or destroyed. Oops. Whip around the flank. Get my skirmishes up on the high ground. Bell Jaeger Sophia are in position to engage. Drop into two square formations. Okay, howitzers are now in within range. Start to drop some quick lime. Within range. For the most part, this infantry unit broke, understandably. 
all my infantry engaged. That felt Jaeger unit I need to take them out because they're just shooting our squares. Charged in. How oh, it says round shot. Just round shot jumps bodyguard. Infantry advance, cavalry advance. Maintain the integrity of the square. Push forward, secure the gun line. They've dropped a lot of stakes, so we need to be. A little bit careful. Send my cavalry off into the mountains. They've been shattered. Enemy general's bodyguard is under fire. You man, get out of square, into line. Don't go for the carabiner. You go for the horse artillery in the distance. You men go for the howitzer unit here. There we go. Potentially devastating initial attack, but rapidly became something else. You men kill the horse artillery crews. They've been ridden down. Damn right, we're going to continue. We can do a lot of damage to these fellows. Artillery ceasefire. There's Jaeger in the center, and I'll allow that. There we go. Try and shoot that last Jaeger. There you got him. Okay, if we do this properly, we might be able to just we might be able to annihilate the army in a single swoop. Remains to be seen though. Okay, keep there you go. Mow them down. Three left. They're, they're gonna go. Two, one. Kaplui. Line infantry are going down first, but probably not enough. No, that guy made made it close enough to the edge to tap out. But that was a good win. 96 men remaining. Of course there's enough for them to carry on surviving. Just kill them. Just end them. And then sit in Nice, where it is nice. You men reinforce. These troops come through the north. He's got Milan up here as well. Nice. Okay, so down here, like you said, I don't mind losing Zagreb. Just keep holding on. Everybody just reinforce. So don't mind, this is we're kind of stirring up troubled territory right here. Great steam engine factory. Who are you? Yeah, that's a bunch of recruitment out of Prague. But nobody's actually going to exploit it. You're building up your Dock of troops. Sir. So you got three cavalry, one heavy horse artillery. Okay, you need. Now you've you've got some 
Woods artillery coming from Norway. Ready for so your foot artillery is good. Your howitzers are good. Okay, garrison guard, engineer, and then actually let's get try and get guerrilla mercenary unit and a no no more skirmishes. Very well. Line infantry it is. Do you want to build up this army? Because if we if, well when we start to get to have to deal with uh, war with Prussia, you know they've got some firepower to bring to bear, including some fleets, a really good fleet with a rocket ship as well. Okay, make sure these armies are still replenishing. Again, these are just to provide a bit of a northern defence. Although you very much don't need. Let's take away three of your infantry. Because, Mr. Henley, you would like some more guns. Stephen Burgess. You're not recruiting anything. You just need just need an infantry unit. Very well. Take a grenadier guard unit from here. Okay, recruitment carries on in the UK. Got your skirmishers, got two cavalry. Let's take one more cavalry and one more infantry. Nice, then you're ready to rock and roll. I think for the most part that's Europe dealt with because everybody's either replenishing or can't really. Actually, you can move. Full chat. Push towards Prague. Army. Andrew Finch. Oh, Let's should we engage these Prus oh, these uh, Austrians in the north on the border. I think we should. So they are going to retreat, or they really have retreated into towards Hanover. We can't attack Hanover yet because the enemy, well, Hanover is an ally of, of Prussia. Oops, sorry, it's my phone. <laughs> um, they're an ally of Prussia and we don't want to start off a war with Prussia yet. We want to, well, we need to at the very least break the back of the Austrians, which we are very close to doing. Okay. And artillery on the right. Open fire as you please. Howitzers are going to the safety of this hill. Open fire. Our line is going to push forward into the town. I'm going to mass my guard and skirmishes on the right where the artillery can provide some cover the bulk of the cavalry is going to be on the right curacy air is going to be on the left this curacy air can handle themselves better Ooh, yikes shrapnel shot attack ground there because it's Infantry here, push up to the high ground. Get my infantry pushing up here rapidly. Okay, looks like these aren't this isn't the big army that's coming in. Good. Still might try something. Get my horse grenade guards up here. Give them a volley. Shrapnel shots coming in as well. Then 
once they're in range, my... Okay, you guys don't need to shoot anymore. Okay, howitzers. Undimba! These men advance through around the town on the right. These men advance through the town on the left. Okay, my army is all split up. Engage. I have to unlimber their guns up. Oh, it says advance onto the high ground. Okay, that appears to be the last of it. The last of that army. There were a few smaller units coming in. Okay, foot artillery. I suppose the foot artillery likes to wants to be up here. Howitzers can get down into the mess. Good. Human advance. Light dragoons. These men get out of the get out of the town as quickly as possible. I'll be ready to form a defensive position. Form square. That's not the general's bodyguard coming in. My cuirassier were firing or attacking their cuirassier, but a bit of a it's a bit of a wash. Killed the enemy, killed an enemy general. Excellent. That means you guys can get out of square, push forward, engage the enemy infantry. Squares are holding their own against the dragoons. Us in musket fire, and if you don't do anything, bring my general's bodyguard over here. Right, you guys are gonna jump on him. are almost in a position to do some good work. My cuirassiers are going to break. My infantry units here are going to fall in the face of that enemy charge. Push forward. No skirmishers. Be hidden. Can't afford to be hidden now. Oh, it says I'm limber. You have to try and get around behind them. My general over here as well. Go 
Lucas here. Great, that's to be expected. Okay, line infantry guards, get over here. Let's see if we can surround this engagement, turn it into a bit of a cauldron for them. Enemy cavalry are coming in. Bring my general over here. This might be a bit of a morale battle. Drop into squares. Get in there. They're not men. Your general is here. These line infantry guards are coming in. We've got the enemy in a real pocket here. Okay, the gunners are dead. You men get in against the grenadier guards. Skirmishers just try and scamper over here. You men attack the Jaeger. Horse Grenadier Guards nail it over here. Charge the skirmishers! Grenadiers charge the Horse Grenadier Guards. Fusiliers are going down thick and fast because they're not very good at melee. That's where the Grenadiers are going in. My artillery is finally in position. Charge down the hill. Everybody. A regiment of horse can deal with them. The grenadiers can engage them. The skirmishers just cease fire. There we go. One new unit of fusiliers is routing. We're not going to charge my cavalry because I'll just kill my guys. Get in here. They form square. So get in here, fusiliers. Get in here, infantry guard. Bodyguard in here. Start chasing down some of these units. Okay, let's get him killed. Get him taken out. I think that is it. Excellent. You may form up. Where's my okay, horse grenadier guards? Go chase the unit that's going in the other direction. Those are Kyosier, don't worry about them. Go after the Jaeger. There's only one Fusilier left. Okay, he's been shot down like a dog. You, come on, kill the Freikor. Good, you've got them as well. Okay, just, you just kill some of these guys. Wipe them from the map. And you've got them. Everybody here is going after these mercenaries. Seven, six, two, one. He's dead. Now it's up to you. Handful of Jaeger. Yep, they too have fallen. Okay, so that's the that set of fragmented units dealt with.
Andrew Finch is ready if they want to try again. Yes, your humble servant. Ready for orders. You're at full strength, so you can start marching east. You are waiting for one unit. Oh, it says, but you could still march east. You're recuperating and, and keeping hold of, well, trying to bring the people of Stuttgart into the fold. But still, this was quite a significant capture, significant thing for us. Uh, ooh. <laughs> the people are very upset in Vienna. Very upset. They're very war weary. A lot of clamour for reform. Yeah, it's going to cause problems for Austria um, and India itself. Oh no, sorry, you were not them, you were for this guy. Make ready. March. Keith Cooper, force. Lloyd Carter, you're waiting on your own artillery. Yeah, one's already been recruited. Here, you're recruiting stuff for yourself. Abraham Pitt, just Virtue you're just sweeping north again up into Kutak. Onward. Make ready. Sir. Prepare for action. And we're just sitting here laying siege because it's not we're not Sir. massively bothered about this ready. part of the world yet. March. And okay. You're a full strength. Stay March up to here rapidly. You're going to cross over the river just to make sure this area stays secure from Maratha raiders. You're going to put Eugene under siege. You're you're going to put a diaper under siege. Yeah, this is putting this is a real this is a real blow for the uh, <laughs> for the Maratha Confederacy. That's a couple of other major towns they're about to lose. I think one town... I suppose actually one, if we take Srinagar, Kabul and Zahedin should become Afghanistan. Rather than... Um, rather than be you know, independent territories. Let's push spies up there. Okay, let's attack Eugene. Capture that from the Maratha dogs. We're, we've We've broken the back of both of these factions so I think it's important we maintain that pressure sweep them out of our lands, secure them permanently and then we'll drive through the Middle East into the Ottoman Empire and then carnage will be brought to the rest of Europe then we can sweep across North Africa into Eastern Russia through to Ankara it's going to be glorious Okay, so the enemy have mortars. We can place... This is going to be where we're going to put our foot artillery. Oh, it's just to the front. Okay, we're going to deploy... Like so. Skirmishes and heavy infantry on the left to help cover the guns. We kind of want to just stay away from the town in general. That's where my heavy cavalry is going to be. But really we don't want to fight there. Actually, if we can get up to here with my line... Skirmishes and so on can get up to here. Gunners want to target other units. Particularly the cavalry. Although as units come, come into quick line range we definitely want to hit them. Push forward. Bring up my horse.
Force Guards. Dari Horsemen. Set up. So we're against camel gunners. Camel gunners aren't terrible. You men all drop into square. Okay, retarget my artillery because they are now engaging the wrong targets. Camel gunners aren't shattered. Something like that. You guys can try and whip around the edge. Yeah, you're gonna have to do put in a lot of put in some work on the left flank. Here come the dervishes. Okay, make sure our Okay, quick line is going to be focus on the enemy infantry blocks. Cavalry, get over here. Fourth Light Dragoon is going to go for the enemy artillery. Cavalry go for the dervishes. This should be nicely exposed. Charge! My infantry, skirmishers, got some marines in here as well. There we go, we broke the dervishes. Infantry, get into, get into here, this position and form your line. Keep killing the dervishes, just to try to see if we can shatter them. Kill the mortars. Tribe auxiliary attack the armed populace, see if we can shatter them. And then reload. Well, here we go, the shots, shots are coming in. We did make it to our lines. Gunners, all of you engage the Pudgy Pudgy infantry. There we go. I knew, I knew they'd be back. Because it's what dervishes do. Just don't run. Come on, armed populace, break and run so we can reform the line. Excellent. Winning decisively. Excellent work. Territory captured. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, upgrade. Re rebuild the roads. Let's not go mad upgrading buildings yet because their enemy, the enemy is. Uh... Although Marlin Rose could very much attack the city. Hmm. 
I think what Marlon Rose would rather do, though, is smash right into the middle of this army. Mm, yeah. Mm. I mean, they could. For sure they could. I want to see if these guys group up, really. That would be a lot simpler. So you men replenish. Key thing is the roads. You want to speed up the movement of our troops through the area. Uh, Simeon, seat. let's attack the garrison at Udaipur. Although they have, they have, yeah, they, this would be a proper siege assault. That's not terrible. They have no mortars. Let's do it. Capture the city. Well, they've got no mortars, so that'll make things a lot easier. There are the enemy do have reinforcements coming in, but it's one cavalry unit, and three dervishes. Don't really mind. I think it'd be worth. Worth, worth capturing the city and destroying the garrison. And then we need to start just chasing up all of the Maratha armies around India that we haven't dealt with yet. Okay. Howitzers just dump quicklime on the enemy everywhere. Don't care where, just do it. Cavalry, mass on the right. The artillery. Say I don't care, I do care. And that place is the middle. The middle is where I want the quick climb. Hey, camels. Well, that knocked some, some hole in them. a lot of dead camels. Some garrison Hindu warriors in here as well, but it is more about the camels. Actually, most of their army is in camels. Fact. Ceasefire... Ceasefire the... Ah. Uh, because they ceasefired the effort to break down the walls. Because that might have caused these guys to redeploy, but apparently not. Artillery! Let's have another quick line volley. Shells away. Hey, buddies. Yeah, plenty. Of camels to kill. There you go. Spread the fire out. Let's fire around. Infantry, advance. So we're going to make a second breach here. Probably a third breach on the corner. And you get a bit of friendly fire, perhaps. Excellent. Collapse the corner. Some misses kind of struck near the centre of this camel slaughterhouse. There we go. Now the sounds sound, sounds all like they're all have kicked in. Killed a few marines with friendly fire, but I don't mind. Misfires. Can use round shot to attack the centre. All my camera against wants to go on the left. There's more entrances. Round shot will do okay. Attacking camels in the centre. All oh, these commanders. might accidentally breach a wall further back due to the misses. Okay, line infantry. They're all going to form. Yeah. You're going to form. We're going to push up. We're going to 
We're going to push up and we're going to assault some of the walls and force them to come out and try and stop us. Get some of the marines in, continental marines. Get set up. Okay, one gun, drop shell. Drop shots here, one drop shots here. Oh no, sorry. I thought I had captured the wall. I thought I had knocked the wall down, but apparently not. Okay, you guys, on the other hand. Let's keep two cavalry units over here. the section of the that's the corner section dealt with okay, now my infantry can start to attack some of these units that are based outside the walls okay, let's try to scale the walls because we know they hate it in that case get my cavalry up here to cover this section I mean, saying because we know they hate it, so it makes it sound like, oh no, they, I, I hate it when they siege, it, when they attack the walls. It's like, no, they don't want you to attack the walls. They don't hate it. You get the gunners to attack ground outside of the wall. How it says to attack ground quick line. No, no, you don't. You go up this way. You don't go inside. That, that wants to go down there. The mercenaries get back up there. Don't worry about them. Cavalry, get in. Native or tribal auxiliary, get in. Bunch of these guys need to just run away from the wall as a hot, as a general rule. Okay, keep attacking. The you know, tribal auxiliary just get here and just keep putting volleys into the center. Grassier will peel off and attack the enemy. Give everybody just give everybody orders to charge through for the time being. The gunners ceasefire, howitzers switch to round shot, attack in the center. So skirmishes just get up here somewhere. Yeah, you guys just where whatever you do, just stay up here and just shoot. Captured all of the gates. That's fun. Okay, so we're still we're attacking there. You, I suppose, better stop. Charge through. You men secure the armory. You men 
get over here. Okay, even attack. Well, you guys set up and engage the enemy infantry in the rear. Get into the charge through the breach. Attack the enemy general. Get up here. Okay, they're probably mowing through my guys up there. Okay, you guys attack the Bajir infantry. You attack the Polygar, they're going to be trying to intercept us. You men attack the Lancers on the in the centre. You've killed the last of the Camels, so attack the 12 Pounders. Fire it well off. So you're just shooting into the back of this melee combat because what heroes do. Run the Regiment of Horse up. You guys charge the back of this block of chaps attacking our cavalry. You men clear out the last of these lancers. Kill the enemy general. Up here things are going okay. Yeah, our troops are cutting through them. Nice. Kill the Lancer. You kill Polygar. Okay, how it says stop firing because you're going to be doing more harm than good. Great. And the uh, sentry secured. Oh, the enemy reinforcements are. Oh, okay. That's part of the reason why they were upset. The enemy reinforcements charged them in the rear. You form square. General's bodyguard, get out of the way. Gunners, just spray this area with shrapnel shot. Attack the bodyguard. Attack the camel mercenaries. Guys, attack the Bajir Lancers in the rear. You men cease fire. Okay, you men, man these guns. This infantry unit continue to attack the last Islamic swordsmen. You men, man these guns. get in don't let them come this way no no i think no no a lot of them have collapsed but not all of them then my general shot in take advantage of some of the glory to be had you guys okay i think these guys are effectively bugged they're never going to be Right, not that it matters, but they could have been shooting these guys. Oh dear. Warm up a blocking party. City has been captured. Excellent. Good. Uh, let's just wipe them out while we can. Okay, repair, reinforce. Yeah, they, they're not going to have the the numbers really to do what they think they want to do. Okay, I can combine some of these troops together. 
provide three spaces because that's kind of the point of recruiting mass recruiting company infantry so i can just combine and combine units create gaps that i can fill up with other units okay something like this three spaces three company infantry Upgrade the mine, upgrade the roads. No colleges to destroy here. Nice. You're in a good position, ready to put to attack some of these armies next turn, although they should be really suffering from a budget perspective. They're not bankrupt yet. Well, no, they aren't bankrupt. Okay, you are going to engage Alok Aluri. Because where they've got more reinforcements coming in from the north, we want to interdict that flow of supplies. Or that flow of reinforcements. We've cut their, their empire in two. Now we need to just kind of widen that cut. I think if we take... Well, yeah, I'm pretty sure... Um, Kashmir and Zahedin will become the independent nation state of Afghanistan, which will not be independent or a nation state for very long. Gunners and Limba. Okay. You know, skirmisher and a continental. Marine unit on each flank. Bowman on one flank. Gunners obliterate that camel nomads. Howitzers and will obliterate that Siladar Lancer unit. hits on the Lancers, but they definitely want to kill us. Stand up and be recognised. We now start to pick off the Camel Nomads. Fire at will! Light cavalry pursue the camels because they are. I am a lot faster than they are. Let's just try. Quick blow some of their problem infantry blocks. If they can, if they turn around and fight, we're. Like light cavalry is literally the worst. That's why they're trying to protect their traitorous camels. Okay, if they're gonna if they're gonna drag us away from the camels, then I want to pull them pull my men back. Chase me, dervishes. Chase me! If get close enough, my natives with bows and arrows are going to start firing as well. Continental Marines here, Buster. Oh, there we go. The camels have resisted 
resisted retreating. us, I think. Okay, pursue. Okay, let's try and get my general over here ready to deal with those Gurkhas when they arrive. To my Kyosier, mop up the Lancers. Attack ground quick line has been more effective than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> okay, they're shattered, so I want to use my artillery. Engage the general's bodyguard. Even though the Gurkhas are shattered, I want my general to kill them. Target priority. You've nearly killed the last of his dervishes. General is still alive, though. Let's try. Oh, not anymore, he's not. Okay, kill the dirt. Kill the Gurkhas. That's the priority. The light cavalry getting into the area. Kill the Sikh warriors. Artillery sees fire. Mowing those seat warriors down. Chop up the Gurkhas. Gurkhas are units they can actually recruit from uh, Kashmir to the north. So it's very, very worthwhile killing them because it's it's an exceptional unit they can't get anywhere else on the field. I do love the Gurkhas. Okay, run over this way. I think for the most part, lots of these units have retreated through the town, so it's going to make killing them difficult because they've been split up and pathfinding is pathfinding is hard. Let's use my general to help my cuirassier kill the enemy Gurkhas. You should get everybody to kill the Gurkhas. You're never going to kill any of these other, these other units, so let's just try and focus them all on one. Pathfinding's fixed because you have so many cavalry. Nice. Very nice indeed. The reinforcing army's been obliterated. Osbert, replenish. Daniel Green, you need an artillery piece and a howitzer. Then you're going to start churning out. Company infantry. You're gonna have to get ready to hold this territory. Um, so you're not in range. You're replenishing. This is done. Okay, I think for the most part. Okay, four recruitment slots. 
You're all going to be done. Let's recruit the sloop to get you moving. Good. Okay. I think it's time to enter and see what the enemy does. Or not does. Does or not does. That doesn't make sense. Does or doesn't do. <laughs> oh well. Oh, Spain. Yes, bring an army to fight. Yeah, we've very much just completely forgotten about all of the trade stuff because it's not super important now. I think, well, I'm hoping, because Austria's just got a lot of a lot fewer cities to organise. You know, yes. Let's see how many damage. Let's see how much damage our garrison can do. They killed one and a half thousand Austrians. Good job you've got Zagreb, Austria. Or else you might be thought to be in trouble. Oh, they're going. They're going in to fortify northern Italy. Yep, Austria, you're in trouble. You can raid as much as you like. I don't mind. So this is the kind of thing that happens in the background that makes you think, if you can't see it, that nothing's happening. Gathering their strength. Slowly making a full army. Um, Auto-resolve the garrison, yes. So I think we, we might own Hungary now. Yep, that's a huge problem for Austria, because now we've got a city to defend. Unless they immediately attack it with, with a lot of guys. Uh, okay, yeah, this might be tricky. <laughs> um, Hungarian Fusiliers. Melee attack 8 versus melee attack 4 for my African native infantry. Okay, so this, mu this might still be not possible. But looking at the timer, I believe it's time to end the episode. So... Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time for the defense of Hungary. I've got the feeling that the objective will be just to kill as many Austrians as we can. <laughs> Radio. See you, everyone.